we recently went into Orchard Square just off Fargate in Sheffield City Centre to see what's new. There was so much going on, there were so many places to eat, drink and shop and loads more. Orchard Square has been part of the city centre for many years. Um, but I think now things are changing. Uh, you can have your nails done, you can have your hair done, um, you can go and grab yourself a sandwich, you can go and have a full meal, um, you can sit on the terrace and, and relax a bit with a cocktail, um, or you can come into Waterstones where I am now before you then um, go back into the Millet, off to TK Maxx, grab a bargain or two, I know I have. If you're not feeling a coffee from Waterstones, you can just pop across the way to Costa or grab a bubble tea from Cup of Char. Or if you'd rather do some retail therapy, why not have a look around Blue Banana, the perfume shop, the body shop, or Clark's, just to name a few. The Terrace Goods menu includes pizza by the slice and crack chick chicken, which you can have as mild or as spicy as you want. But they also do loads of vegan options, and if you fancy a cheeky cocktail, they will definitely sort you out. Or you could go next door to Macpot, Sheffield's very first mac and cheese restaurant. But if that's still not enough for you, you can always head downstairs to Sheffield Plate. I am Jake, I'm the venue manager at Sheffield Plate. In my opinion, we're the best new food hall in Sheffield. So we have six international food vendors. We have the Orchid Tap, which is a craft ale bar, and Liquor Labs, which is a cocktail and spirits bar. And we offer weekly entertainment and a pub quiz every Thursday. There is such a good atmosphere in the Sheffield Plate as soon as you walk through the doors. You can choose from Sri Lankan food, Romanian food, Peruvian, Thai, Portuguese, or go for some chicken wings. And afterwards, you can head downstairs for some drinks with your mates. And we look forward to welcoming you. Come down anytime. We'll be happy to see you here. We're delighted at Orchard Square that we have chosen our charity for the next year, and that is the Archer Project. And the Archer Project supports and helps people who are homeless in the city. One of the things that um, Orchard Square is looking forward to is working with the Archer Project to help demonstrate how we as a city can support people who are on the street. All I'd say is give Orchard Square another look this Christmas and also for next year there's a lot of changes happening.